Mercury in stacked gases is mainly of elemental and ionic species. There are a few methods to measure mercury emitted from stacked gases. In JISK0222, US EPA Method 29 and 101A, or EN13211, glasswares and reagents are needed during sampling at the stack. Using potassium permanganate as the absorbing solution, gaseous mercury emitted from the stack is trapped. Alternatively, for method EPA 30B, a halogenated carbon based on sorbent trap is used to trap the mercury. Regardless of the method used, absorbing solution or sorbent trap will still require laboratory analysis to obtain the mercury results. No real-time or on-site reading is possible. Cautiously, when using absorbing solution method, reagents with low mercury blank are needed to avoid false biased results. Glassware of the sampling train must be cleaned thoroughly to reduce mercury memory effect. Sampling train is bulky, and an ice bath is often necessary to cool down the sampling train. On-site gas matrix volume calibration is often necessary to ensure sampling volume accuracy which directly affects mercury measurements. In the sorbent trap method, although wet chemicals usage is avoided, precise measurement of gas flow and total volume are still critical to final reporting result accuracy. The sorbent trap must still be post-analyzed in laboratory, presenting possible handling error, thus affecting the final mercury result. Regardless the choice of methods, the effort is only sampling. After sampling, technicians must rush back to the laboratory to analyze emission result. What if you're able to perform sampling and measurement directly on-site? SGM-9 is a field portable mercury monitor designed for on-site stack gas measurement of total gaseous mercury and its species. It consists of two main components, WLE-9 and EMP-3. At the chimney sampling point, a continuous stream of stack gas is drawn through a dust filter and a heated transfer line into the WLE-9 where the sample gas is treated with three scrubbers. In the first scrubber, any ionic mercury is readily reduced by stannous chloride to elemental mercury. The gas stream with elemental mercury moves on to the second scrubber where sulfur oxides and nitrogen oxides are removed in potassium hydroxide solution. Before entering the detector, the sample gas stream is dehumidified by electric cooler, omitting the need for ice bath. The dried sample gas with elemental mercury proceeds to measure by CVAAS within the EMP3, which is the second part of SGM-9. The measurement is continuous in real time. With SGM-9 that provides on-site sampling and measurements of mercury from stack gas, you can get real-time measurement results available directly on-site. No more laboratory work and long turnaround time. Smarter reagent management as SGM-9 uses simple reagents and has low consumption rate. No mercury blank issue as potassium permanganate is omitted. True mercury emission profile as measurement reading is instantaneous and not affected by flow rate and sampling volume. Ergonomically designed and handy stack gas monitor for easy transport. Most importantly, SGM-9 complies to the Japanese JISK0222 Procedure 3. Stack gas mercury monitoring can now be done with confidence and efficiency. Contact us now to know more about SGM-9, a better and more efficient solution for your stack gas mercury monitoring.